Hey guys, welcome back. Modi101 here, and we are back, back, back in Nuts and Bolts, picking up a bit after we left off. You can see we're still hungry, but we got some different food stuff coming in. I put up a couple extra little chests here. I keep getting books. Made some more seared bricks, which we really found out last episode that we don't super need right now, but we got some. Uh, we got our little bit of a farm going over here. Uh, I don't know if there's out. Oh, we'll get some corn. Anything else that needs to be done? Doesn't look like. Oh, those. Okay. All right. So we got a little bit of food. Did I step on that? I did step on that. Okay. And it looks like night is rolling in. So let's get this food put away. And, oh, come on. Touch the water. Touch the water. Touch it. There we go. All right. <clears throat> so let's get a little, uh, looky loo at our book here and kind of see if I remember correctly we were kind of a ways off the first thing we needed to make was iron dust uh, and we needed constructed grindstone from layers to turn ore into dust for smelting and to make a grindstone let's see grindstone we needed quartz some sort of quartz, and I don't think I found any. Not that I can see. Now, this is that other iron, which we hit uses. We can do it this way. Maybe we'll try that. Oh, we need iron ingots. Do I have any iron ingots yet? Damn, I need iron ingots to make that. Alright. Um, Let's see what our options for iron ingots are. Okay. Iron ingot. All right. So we can get it from nuggets. Industrial craft credits. Blocks. Whoa. I don't know how to get this stuff. Yag dust. How the hell do you get yag dust? All right, okay, all right, different options, different options. Uh, crushed iron ore, iron dust. Um, but I need, I need to make a smeltery, and to make the smeltery, let's look that up again, I'm having a little bit of a brain fart. Uh, at tank, okay. 11 freaking pages. Uh -uh. You know what? Let's just type in smelt. Alright, so to get the smeltery controller, we have to have a block of coal coke. Okay. Which, how do we get? No, I need just regular block of coal coke. We get that from building a coke oven. Okay, we're nowhere near that. And then to build a... Alright, so here's my... Where's my pickaxe? Did I lose my pickaxe? I guess I had a Hobble one. I'll just make another one. All right. So here's the issue. We're kind of stuck with iron. All right. Now I've done some mining, as you guys can see. See, super diggy hole. You can see I've come down here. I found some uranium, which I can't get yet. It needs diamond. Osmium I can get, but I don't need that yet. Ventium needs diamond. Redstone needs diamond. Um, got some more Ventium, some more Redstone here. I have yet to come across any, um, of the Certus Quartz, okay? We got Gold Ore here, we got Emerald, we got Osmium, we got a little bit of Clay Underground, and most of these we need Diamond for. Um, and we have yet to find any, even coming up this way and looking up as we go. There's some stuff there with some of the iron. So, 
I'm worried that I need to find diamonds. So if that's the case, I think for now, we are going to need to work on a couple more basic things. Okay, stick with me here. First of all, we need to start building a home. I think we need to get a home, and I think we need to get a better farm area. Um, and let's look something up real quick. Uh, and it looks like we can only make... Oh, man, even a regular bucket needs... How do you get that? Okay, that's not too bad. Oh, and then tin. Um, I don't think we've come across any tin yet, have we? But we need to make a bigger farm. Now, if you guys have noticed that I put down a couple gardens that I've come across, hoping that they're going to spread um, and give us more gardens. But we have yet to get that lucky, so... But we do need to get a structure set up, and it looks like I'm just going to have to kind of mine a bunch and get... But see, to get diamonds, I need iron. And I've yet to find regular iron. Uh, yeah, see, that's different than the block of coal coke. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, just a fuel source. Okay. Uh, let's look up this real quick. Coke oven. Coke, uh, Coke bricks. We would need tiny coal, seared brick, wow, and nether brick, which we get from nether rack. Or a fluid transposer, which we don't have. Um, so that means, okay, so it looks like maybe going to the nether is what we need to do, but the only two ways would be to get obsidian, which we would need a higher end pick, or to build it the little cheaty way using buckets of water and lava, which is fine, except we can't make a bucket until we find tin. All right, so we're going to work this episode. I know this is, what is this? It's osmium. Let's get this cobble out. Yeah, I haven't found any tin yet that I can tell. I got some copper. And I'm sure there's something I'm missing. You guys are freaking out about it, but I cannot for the life of me figure it out. Okay, so let's go ahead and start our, our little, little mini structure here. Kind of clean up this area a little bit. All right. And I'm thinking about kind of putting it close to this water. So let's go ahead. We're not going to do anything huge and extravagant. Let's go maybe like 13, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then maybe go 13 out as well. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. All right. Nothing more exciting than building with Modi. Right? Right? Counting with Modi. I'll be playing the part of Modi. All right. So we got that. Oh, really? Come on. So this pack looks like it's going to be tricky. Um, let's hope it doesn't frustrate me so bad. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, cool. All right. And let's go ahead and convert this over and start building up ourselves a little home. Like I said, nothing too crazy. Get a couple of windows here in the front. And then probably not a whole lot down the sides just because uh, we want space to be able to put stuff. That was a mistake. All right. So we're building we're building a patented box. We can spruce it up later or dark oak it up later, depending on what we feel like. Don't judge me. Did I run out? Oh, jeez. I got scared there for a minute. All right. So let's build this up. Little place so that possibly we can still work through the nights. I don't know how bad the nights are. Food is going to be our primary concern. Um, just because I gotta be able to, gotta be able to eat, right? Gotta eat. Nobody's gotta eat. All right, and then do that, and then like that should be good. And I'm out. Okay, we gotta get more wood. All right, um, let's go check out our food situation. Um, I've eaten that recently. 
Uh, what happened? What about this? Yeah, I've eaten that recently. These we can try and cook up real quick. There we go. Let's eat a couple strawberries just to so we don't start dying over here. All right. Wow, they do not give you much, do they? We are on our own. All right, so we get some more dark oak trees. Keep clearing out this area. That's rubber wood. That's not what I want. That's what I want. All right. And let's keep doing this. Getting what we can. Leave the rubber trees. Dark oak is good. All right. Darn it. And there we go. Okay, you give me that. That's mine. Thank you. Alright. Anyways, guys. So, yeah. I mean, let me know, uh, you know, if you guys know much about this series. I Like I said, I, I feel it's one of those. I'm hoping that it's one of those that, like, once it gets kind of rolling, it's not too bad. I, I, I don't hate recipe changes, per se, um, as long as there's a little bit of logic in it. And not just, like, I'm going to make it to be super hard because that's funny to me, you know. Not in a trolley kind of way. So, you know. Let me know if you guys have played this. You guys usually do. Alright, there's got plenty of wood. Can I sleep yet? I can. Okay. Alright, let's finish uh, getting a little bit of a, a home going. Alright, so maybe I'm almost to, like, have a... Th oh, I did this wrong, didn't I? Um, I'm almost uh, have a thought process of, like... Maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to do a little bit more exploring because we may come across some place that has a chest that has a couple iron ingots in it that can then get us a um what should we call it? A uh bucket. And then once we have a bucket, then we can probably do a couple more things. Alright, so we cook these up. Oh, I have eaten these recently, damn it. Uh, let's grab... See, food's going to be another issue we're going to have here in the not-too-distant future. Let's do that. Uh, let's see what kind of sand I have. Maybe get a little couple glass panes going. Uh, we have some. Let's go ahead and do that and toss this in here. And then, can I make a door? Can I make a normal old door? I can. Wonderful. <clears throat> All right, so not the most amazing thing on the planet, but it is our little home away from home. Let's do this real quick and make sure this bad boy is well lit so we can keep the baddies out, if we can even keep the baddies out. And let's see how much this affected out here. Pretty bad. There, there. Just a little something to kind of keep the mobs away. Just a bit. All right. Um, probably going to use glass pane, so I just need to get to six. Let's turn that off. All right, uh, let's go ahead while we're waiting on that and just move a couple things into the old abode here. We'll use the windows while we can, and we'll just set these up in the corner and then just kind of transfer all this in here. Oh, I have glass. Well, whatever. You guys are probably yelling at me about that. It's okay. We'll survive. Everybody calm down. It's not that big of a deal. We'll be fine. All right. And then we can toss this stuff in here to make room to get the other stuff. Uh, let's do that. Okay. And then we'll grab this guy. Let's grab everything we can out of here. Uh, inventory tweaks would be a nice thing, but, eh, we deal with what we deal with, right? Alright, get this stuff all put away, like a so. Every time I log in, I have another quest book, and I don't know why, and it kind of bothers me. Alright, let's get the rest of this out of here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. See how many quest books I have? It's ridiculous. All right, and then I think we're going to probably try and venture out, and I guess try and live off the land, try and pick up some more gardens, see if we can come across something, anything that maybe, just maybe, we can get our hands on um, 
some uh, some loot. I think that might be kind of important. Um, all right, and lastly, all the food. I want to kind of keep this stuff separate. All right, let's do that. You know, let's do this real quick. Let's pull this out, and let's actually let's cook up that bread into toast. That might be a very good idea. All right, get this food put away. Why is there just a book there? Why would it be there? Whatever. All right. Well, I'm. You know what? Whatever. Okay. And like so. I know this is super duper exciting for you guys. Hope you guys are all doing well. Hope the world is treating you right. Uh, for those in the U.S., I. You know, I gotta think. When does this come out? This comes out on Friday. So, uh, yeah, it comes out a little bit before uh, 4th of July for any of the U.S., you know, celebrate that. Be safe out there. Don't blow your hand off. And, um, <clears throat> and uh, yeah, I hope you guys have a good time. I, I, for any of you guys that don't know, I used to own an ice cream truck. I did that for years. And um, the, uh, the whole um, 4th of July thing was kind of like a... A pretty busy day, you know, you get a lot of people who are barbecuing and families over and everything's exciting and whatnot, so, um, yeah, there were, you know, the, it was, a, it was a, like I said, a pretty busy day for me, but I will admit I am uh, more than happy that I don't have to deal with that anymore, and I don't mean that in a super negative way, I just mean in the fact that, like, I can actually go hang out with my daughters and watch fireworks as opposed to, you know, seeing them from my car or my ice cream truck. That was always kind of annoying, but so that'll be fun. I mean, we'll do some barbecue stuff. All right, there we go. Let's put this stuff away here. Okay, we got our toast, which gives us a, a, a good little thing here. We got ourselves a home set up. And, um, you know, we're almost near the end of this episode, so let's just kind of see what we got around here. So we got some cotton, which can help us get some string, which will be handy. I get a feeling this is going to be a pretty heavy foraging pack, like trying to get as much stuff as we can. And a lot of these mushrooms. Let's do this. Let's grab these, and then let's actually put these over by the house. All right. How many did I get? I got four. Oh, it grew one right at the last second. That's nice. All right. So we'll, we'll do these for a little bit of decoration, a little bit of food as well. Um, we need a bucket. We need some. Well, we need tin to do that. The rest of it we can kind of do on our own. All right. So we got ourselves some blueberries. Let's see what else we can kind of forge from right around our home. And then next episode we will head out and see what kind of trouble we can get into. I also need it to be night uh, so I can sleep in our bed. Thank you for the egg, little chickadees. Um, and then I think I want cattails too. Um, we need to sleep in our bed before we take off as well. All right, let's see. We got anything else? I really dig our little island. I, I will say that. I think it's going to be pretty cool. I mean, it seems a little meh right now but as time goes on we're gonna build up quite quite a little little island home and uh you know well I'll, I'll be eventually getting suggestions from you guys which you know some things you want to see in here generally you know like just you know little kind of village thing you know i think i want these i think i need these to make something I get these ones as well all right collect all the mushrooms uh, what do we got here? Ebony wood. Wow, oh, what's that look like? Is that black wood? Wow, that's black wood. I like that. Is there ebony trees around here, or are these just fallen? Oh, they're with my pick. Or my axe. Alright, well, there we go. <clears throat> Alright, so we got ourselves a little bit of a home. We kind of, I mean... We have an idea of what needs to get done. It just, it's just, I feel we have a handful of hurdles we're going to have to kind of get over at the get-go. Primarily food. We're going to, like I said, go do a little bit of exploring next episode and see where that takes us and see what we can do. So, all right, guys, so we got ourselves a little home. We got all moved in and, you know, we discussed kind of 
what we need to do to get here to there to here to there so hopefully we can make some headway next episode so hope you enjoyed the video if you did make sure you hit that thumbs up questions comments concerns put it down in the comment section if you want to get your own modi merchandise head on over to my spreadshirt shop uh don't forget if you want to hang out with myself in the squad and talk to us in discord and play with us on our private server you can go check out the patreon for the details on that and if you want to get your very own minecraft server head over to aim the game use the link down below so they know you're coming from the squad use the coupon code to save yourself some money and until the next episode i want to thank you guys so much for hanging out i'll see you guys next time bye <laughs>